Did you know that the crow is the Einstein of the natural world? You don't? Then take a look at this experiment. It shows a new Caledonian crow trying to get a treat. She realizes she can't get it with her beak, so she takes a stick, but it's not enough to get the treat. That's why there are four other sticks in flasks next to it, and one of them is longer than the others. The crow uses an old stick to pull out the longest one, and then uses it to take the treat. Crows are not just smart birds. They are probably one of the smartest animals after humans. A meta-analysis testing ingenuity in foraging for food in the wild found that crows are the most innovative birds. And in an experiment testing the ability to search for food, crows outperformed even mammals. Ornithologists claim that the mental and cognitive abilities of crows are on par with great apes. And what's really amazing is that the brains of crows, like most intelligent monkeys, have developed the ability to make geometric measurements, which is why the crow in this experiment realized what kind of stick it needed. In this video, you'll learn how crows use tools, solve complex problems, and even trick other animals, why they remember people's faces, what their sense of humor is, and how their behavior can help us better understand the evolution of intelligence in the animal kingdom. Crows have relatively large brains compared to their bodies, although some knowledgeable people might say that the total number of neurons in crows is only about 600 million compared to tens of billions in humans. People think intelligence is proportional to the size or mass of the brain, but for obvious reasons, bird brains should be light. To accomplish this, nature has reconfigured the bird brain so that there is much more communication per unit volume than ours, or vice versa. Their intellectual acuity can be seen in experiments conducted with them. For example, scientists from the universities of Auckland and Cambridge conducted such an experiment. Food was floating in a vessel filled halfway with water, and to get it, the crow had to raise the level of liquid by dipping stones into it. All feathered test subjects easily solved this problem, that excluded chance, moreover, the most intelligent birds chose larger and heavier stones. And this intrigued scientists, because such a task could not be performed by children under seven years of age. These birds are not just capable of using the laws of physics, they can generally solve complex logical problems. They can easily count to five, which has also been proven in experiments. They are literally mathematicians in the animal world. But why would they need such a brain in the wild? First of all, crows live in some of the harshest environments on Earth, where survival requires higher intelligence and better adaptation. In the second place, most crows are omnivores, and many of them live in large family groups and exhibit high social complexity. And what does social complexity mean? The social complexity hypothesis suggests that living in a social group improves the cognitive abilities of animals. After all, to live in such a large group, they must be able to identify each other and keep track of what is going on around them. Crows can distinguish each other by gender age and even social status. They can also use information about other individuals to their advantage. For example, if one crow has found food, it can call other crows that know and trust it. They are also able to warn of danger. What's more, crows have what's called social memory. They remember not only their friends and enemies for several years, but also the voices of other birds. And they can recognize people by face and even understand when you are sad and when you are happy. But you know what really distinguishes an intelligent animal? The ability to deceive. Crows can deceive other animals using their wits and cunning. They can mimic the sounds of other birds or animals to attract them. And they can even mimic the voice of a human. Mischief, can you say hello? Hello. Good bird. But sometimes crows can deceive in the form of a joke. Although crows cannot joke in the sense in which humans do, but they can show their sense of humor and playfulness. For example, they can play with their kin, hide food from each other, and can use tools for fun and games. There are even documented cases of crows rolling down slides or off building roofs on old can lids just for fun.
but you know what surprises me the most. It's possible that ravens have the beginnings of consciousness and culture. It has been observed that magpies take part in elaborate mourning rituals that have been compared to human funerals, including even the laying of wreaths of grass. We are used to seeing crows as ordinary birds that we see every day. They do not look much different from other birds. However, looking at their behavior, we realize that crows can use tools, can count, can work in a team, and communicate with each other, joke, deceive, and are able to show care. They can recognize human faces and even parody our voice. If you like this video, put a like and subscribe. And as always, pump your brains. See you in the next video.